What's up, YouTube? And tune is back. We just had an arrogant uh, spirit make its presence be known in our kitchen. We witnessed our bag of bread just move off the table and open. So we're going to turn on the uh, Echo K2 meter that we have. We're going to see what's the spirit's real intention of being in our kitchen while we're having coffee. So without further ado, time to hit play. And the cameraman today happens to be Jay. Wow. Right off the bat, they're already yelling. So, I'm going to listen. Listen, that makes your volume was up. The last time you didn't have it all the way up. Yeah, that's, that's also important. Volume up. Not down. So, I'm going to put the... Uh... Excuse me? Who just flat out came out and said I was evil? I don't think he was thinking me. Are you the are you the guy that's in our kitchen right now? If you want to communicate, I have a micro I have a microphone right here. We can hear you loud and clear. What is that? What is your name? What is your business here? Let's turn on the white noise. Because usually that helps us. Max, what's your name is? Is it a different language? That is definitely a different language. What language? I don't know. Do you know how to speak English? How many are in this kitchen right now with us? I heard three people. Yeah, a male, two males and a female. What is your purpose of being in our home today? We can hear everything you say most of the things. Because we have a device on right now that can hear... I'm not eavesdropping on you, I'm just letting you know. Man, we know who you are, ma'am. You're in my house. And I'm asking you respectfully, and I'm telling you respectfully, that we can hear you. And I know who you are. If you are peaceful, can you make the K2 sensor go off? Come again? I think he said you don't have to. No, you don't have to. But you can. Why is there an arrogant spirit in my kitchen today? Is there some spirits here that you don't approve of? Are there spirits? We don't need help. That's what it said. We don't need help. Well, hmm. who is the spirit that knocked down my bread? That's why you got a, our attention. You knocked down a piece of my property. Whoever's trying to talk is messing with the volume. Listen. Anishtafu mentekat itibakali. Able panyon? We don't mean no disrespect, we just wanted to know who the arrogant uh, guy was in our kitchen. I believe it was a guy. You knocked down my, my property and that's what made us bring this app on. Well, no, you cannot do whatever you want in our home. This is our home. So I rebuke you. You're not welcome here if you're going to be arrogant. 
Do you have permission to talk to us? From Jesus? The son, the son of God? To the female that came through, we're not trying to be disrespectful. There's just an arrogant soul. We don't know if we have permission to talk to him or not. But he made his presence be known in our kitchen. So we don't mean no disrespect. Right. You're being a little grumpy at us. We're just asking a question because you made your presence known. That's French. I don't speak French. I don't. We don't speak French. If you're trying to communicate with us through this app that we have on, would you please be trying to speak English? What you say? Whoever that was messed with my uh, came in kind of low, cause my volume's up. Oh, they're messing with the volume. Why are you messing with our stuff? <laughs> Who gives you the authority to be in my house right now? To the female that keeps talking, who are you? Is there any family members in the house? So we can speak to somebody that has permission for us? <laughs> well, I, I asked my spirits to come through. Because I don't know why you're here. Multiple's coming through because they're... they're Give them a minute. It, it takes a little while for the, the good spirits to come. Where's the one to my left? That always sits with me. We're just looking for guidance and understanding uh, if we have permission to talk to whoever was trying to disturb our day. Now, we are speaking to you not without permission because you made your presence known by touching my stuff and making it move. So I'm standing up to you. You're not allowed to come to my house and touch my stuff. What is that? I don't know. Well, if you talk while I'm talking, we're not going to understand each other. Yes, I am stepping up to you. This is my house. Well, we would calm down if the arrogant spirit would have never made You're not. You don't have a... Known. For one, ma'am, you don't have authority. On us. You, your arrogant friend over there touched my bread. And I'm asking who he is because he made his presence known without probably permission. So now I'm asking you to identify yourself. There's nobody aggravated here. Only y'all are aggravated. We're trying to talk to you. So the guy that keeps... Wait, they lowered it again. Yeah. They keep messing with the volume. You see it here first, everybody in the, in uh, YouTube. Whoever the arrogant soul is that's being arrogant with us keeps messing with the volume and lowering it when he comes through. So that indicates he don't have permission to talk to us. Right. Which he's rallying up the ones that are that could talk to us. No, I don't know who's rallying them up. Maybe the woman is. But I do rally up my spirits around me. Because I don't know who this arrogant soul thinks he is to come into my house and disturb my stuff. And then let me come over here to talk to you. And then, you know, I'm only asking a question now. And they're saying that we're getting angry and we're not angry. It's the person that's mad right now that, that I'm announcing who touched me. I'm the son of God. I'm a child of God. And my authority is Jesus. Who are you to come into my house without permission? Is what I'm asking. You. To the left of me, got super, super cold just now. I'm just gonna put it back on the hat. <laughs> so you wanted to make your presence known, and you're getting aggravated because I'm stepping up to you. This is my house. My authority is the Trinity. 
Like it or not, the Trinity's welcome here. So I guess he turned his back and you came into the house and smacked my bread over. And I'm I'm not trying to get you in trouble, but who are you what authority do you have to be in my house right now? And touch things without permission. Why well, must you disturb us while we're having coffee and minding our business? Is there something that you wanted to say? Because now we're giving you the opportunity because now we can hear you talk. Did you pass away on this property and we never talk, told your story? You don't tell me to shush because you know what? I'll keep talking. Arrogant or not, I'll keep talking because this is my house. You're not going to tell me to shush. You're disturbing my coffee. Let the, you, baby, you gotta talk and then give him a chance to say something so we can hear it. Not to say you, know, you have to stop talking. Well, I just heard a Spanish woman come through. And the guy that, whoever's messing with our volume and her. That's what I'm saying. This, this arrogant soul came in, touched my bread, and now is playing with my volume. You don't have permission to. You don't have permission. To touch my stuff. Excuse me? Let's take off the echo. Yeah, because it's like... So, all I asked you to do is identify yourself. And what authority I have? The Trinity of God. That's the authority I have to ask you. Now you're going to get mad at me because I'm going to get you in trouble, but you got yourself in trouble. You started this by touching my stuff in my house without permission. So now we're talking to you and if the Holy Spirit comes... If the Holy Spirit comes and gets you in trouble, and you're in trouble because this is your fault. You wanted to be arrogant and touch my stuff. And then you want to tell my wife to shush. Because your arrogance is going to get you in trouble. We're just asking a question. I feel no evil. I know we're not supposed to be talking, but your arrogant... Whoever... I have more authority to speak to you than you do to me. You made your presence be known, and if you're wondering how we're communicating, this is a spirit box communicator, so we can hear every word you say. We wish you could speak English, because we don't understand the language you're speaking. It's all the same, you said. It's all the same. He's looking to get you pissed, so don't get pissed. Well, if you don't have, you want to curse him out? Go ahead, because he's getting his way then. So you respond to me in Spanish, but you want to? She's answering him. She just told him you're responding in. You're, you won't respond in English, but you're responding in Spanish. So if she gets angry in Spanish, that's what you want, and now he's saying quiet. Identify yourself. Who are you? In the name of Jesus, I demand you to identify yourself. Okay, the Holy Spirit is allowed to be in my house right now. Wherever he may be, can he come into this conversation please? Oh, so quiet now. I think the lady shut it down. Oh, no. Someone's messed with the volume. Wait, put it back up. For the record, whoever's here now witnessing this, whoever's coming now in the spiritual world, for the record, there was an arrogant soul. He was 486 years old. He came in, he pushed my bread off my, my creamer, and he's messing with my volume. When, when I ask him who he is, he don't want to identify himself, but he wants to insult my wife.
because I'm stepping up to him, he has a problem with it. I am sitting next to him. I'm direct. So you only can hear us, but you can't see us. Are you the soul that knocked out the the thing in my bathroom? That is a good question. Because you're knocking on. I knock whatever I want, he said in Spanish. Who are you? Who do, who gives you authority? What's your authority here? You guys hear this first. This whoever this arrogant soul is keeps messing with the volume, and now he's trying to uh, insult us in Spanish. But he has he has such a big arrogant heart. And he is in the kitchen with us again. Who gives you authority to be here? Are you standing next to my door? Babe, we gotta ask one question at a time. Every time I ask a question, you keep asking a question. What is that? Why don't you just let her talk and stop interrupting? He keeps telling why don't, me. Why don't you shut up and let me speak to my wife? How about that? I asked you a question before. You didn't want to. You didn't want to answer me. So if you're gonna get me angry, let you be responsible of it. You don't tell me how to speak to my wife. I had asked you already questions. You don't want to answer me. You don't get no authority to stick up for her. I'm not afraid of you. You don't have authority. If the Holy Spirit's here, he's explaining himself to somebody. Whatever may be going on right now with the spirits, understand, he came into my kitchen, knocked over my bread, and now he's telling us to shut up. This is not the first time he's made his presence, is what they're saying um, amongst each other. Right. This arrogant soul has made his presence be known twice in our apartment, and we're thinking he is the one that broke the piece off our bathroom wall. Not 100% sure, but... I haven't. I don't speak French. We don't speak. We don't speak French, so we don't understand you. You shut your mouth. First of all, you don't got authority yet, like I said. Yo hablo español, sí. El marido mío no habla español. Yo hablo español. Porque tú estás un más criado en español. Este tipo está aquí en, mi, en, en, el, en el cocina de nosotros. Nosotros está aquí con un vasito de café. En este tipo vino, co, cogió el bolsa de, de pan. ¿Por qué? He just said, oh shit, she spoke Spanish. All right, to everyone that, to everyone that wants to know what was just said, I am fluent in Spanish. So the lady asked me to, to communicate with her nicely. So I just explained to her in Spanish, for those that don't speak English, that, you know, we were just here minding our business, drinking coffee, and all of a sudden, my husband had an idea to check the spirit out because we watched our bread totally be removed off our creamer. So he turned on a different app, which we can't use at the moment because it's not keep compatible with the tablet, and it showed that we had an arrogant spirit in our kitchen. He's like 486 years old. So, what's going on right now is the spirits are trying to figure out why this arrogant soul is making his presence known. 
Perdóname, no, nosotros no estamos más criados, el tipo está más criado en la cocina de nosotros. He made his presence known by touching my uh, bread and being arrogant to us, so why is it okay for him to speak to me, but I can't speak to him? Okay, they just lowered the volume completely low. Hold on. Yeah. Put it back up. Give me one second, you guys. We have technical difficulty because they do not the want The spirits to... are messing with the app. Yes. And now we have no volume. All right. Turn it off and then put it back on. I think the Holy Spirit came. Yeah. He's answering to that. Well, with that being said, everybody in, in uh, YouTube, this was a episode of In Tune with, uh, with us. Let's try it one more time. Let's give it one more chance before we end this recording. Put it on. Is it on? Yeah. Why don't you shut it off, shut okay. the tablet off completely, and then go back to the app. Okay. Sorry guys, I was just turning the camera around. You see me? Yeah, perfect. We have this event here. She's gonna try to get the audio back on so we can hear what's going on. This arrogant soul came out thinking he can just tell me what to do, tell me to shush up, and he has no authority here. I'm not afraid of them. And before we get the app back on, let me just let you guys 